Hello everybody on the Vision of Chaos and welcome back to another episode of Fire Emblem. You may think I sound different or you may hear my uh, mic going, uh, making weird noises. That's actually because my mic stand just broke while recording something else. And what else is will be a secret. But anyway, let's get on to the chapter. Chapter 12, Birds of Feather. After speaking with the village magistrate, with a mustache, and the wooden company set their sights on Laos. The roads are ferry to Laos passes through Santorus. Elwood suspects his missing father might have visited Santorus en route to Ostia. Elwood arranges a meeting with the local ruling lord to see what he can learn. I wonder what we'll learn. We learned that this is chapter 12, Birds of a Feather! What? Elwood is here? Yes, he has set camp upon a hill south of here. He seeks permission to enter Santoros. He seeks an audience with you. Could it be? Do you think Elwood has come to ask of his father? In that case, I... I know not what to tell him. Tell him you know nothing, and let him be on his way. Yet, I know young Hollywood well. His father, Albert, and I are old friends. I have no children of my own, and I always treasured Hollywood. I do not believe I could look yes, him in the eyes Yes, he has set camp up on a hill I so could not lie to him. He seeks permission to enter Santorans. He seeks an audience with you. Tell him you know nothing, and let him be on his way. Wait, do you mean to harm Elliot? Not harm, frighten. A scratch or two will leave no scars. We will run home to Farai. He'll be done with his adventure. He is, after all, all that Farai has left. It's... Instead of entering Laos with a, such a small group, we should meet with Marcus Santorus and request his assistance. I sense that. I sense that it's a good plan, Vision. Truly so. If you, I tell you again, I'm pleased to have you with us, Lord Helm. He's not only my father's friend. I've known him since I was a child. I'm sure that he will help us. What? What else would be there? <laughs> Noble sirs, arms for a poor villager. Poor villager, you look nothing like an honest man. Clean the road, step quickly or... Step quickly? <laughs> Good advice. Maybe it's you who should follow it. What? Is someone wants a boy in an early grave? It's a shame if you ask me, but he'll die here today. Come on boys, earn your keep. Here we go again, Vision. Just like old times, seems our fate abound. Nelly, how she's still in fairy. I'm working for the, you this time. She, she's not worked to her, to her. Got my axe, Vision! The funny thing about that is, in the playthrough, I uh, have, in the other playthrough, I actually let him die. For this, actually, I, I'm going to try a no death Marcus. Uh, no, uh, no, no death. What's his name again? Molina's run. Yeah, sorry, I forgot his name. Who's Molina's, you ask? Oh, well, you will uh, find out eventually. Let's just uh, end my turn here. Let's just move our characters ahead. And Dorcas, if you die, I'm not going to revive you. Because I'm not go planning on using you anyway. No matter what happens. What? Rebecca, you missed? How could you miss? Really? Oh, that reminds me. I need to set all the animations. Because we're now actually going... Uh, I'm now going to uh, keep the animations on again. Really? Really? I'm having no luck today. Hello, what? You can finish him off, right? 
Yeah, 100%. Hit that, hit percent. You won't miss. Uh, Bartray, I want you to go in front of Rebecca. And you, I don't care what you do, just go on to here. And Marcus, I don't really care about you either. And you're of course going to attack Bartray, but that's to be expected. And Bartray misses and you attack twice. Hmm. That's not good at all. Now Bartray, I want you there. Just wait. You, I want you not to miss. Thank you. Yeah, that's a bit thing uh, that you want. That That's a bit annoying about this game. Is how in the hell do you come up for commentary with this uh, uh, battles and such? You mean, it's just a game that you're gonna need to play in order to, yeah, enjoy it? I, mean, I, I don't know. What am I saying? Of course, every game you need to play in order to enjoy it. Makes sense to me. Bah! He puts up a good fight for a Peppa Noble Pup. It's up to me to finish him. Yeah, this is actually one of the few bosses that is going to move around. Normally bosses don't usually move around. Uh, but this boss does. He's one of the few. Good, good, good. You level up. Bar tree. Bar tree? Bark her up the wrong tree. I don't even know. How many are there? This looks... Hey, what's going on over there? Looks like some rough business. You, soldier, are you just going to stand there and watch? Who do you think you are? This is Santurus. What a curse he has no affair of any brain not lotling. I believe I'm going to have to disagree with you. You see, the man they're attacking happens to be a friend of mine. A friend? What? <sighs> Sorry, but I'm in a hurry. Ew, that's terrible. I loathe violence. Nicely done, my lord. You're a fighter born. I cannot condone to resorting to so for so quickly. Jared, chastise me later, Rawson. First we deal with these braggarts. Come, we must help Elwood. Help Hollywood? Sounds like a convenient excuse for more violence. Oswin? Yes, yes, I'm coming. Matthew, take Sarah and find some place to hide. What? With Sarah? No, I'm not going with you. You, you're not. You'll slow us down. Oh, how rude. Oswin, let's go. Yes, and we get new two new characters in this uh, level. Uh, which are Hector and Oswin, which I'm both going to use. Well, Hector is actually the third lord we'll be getting into uh, in this um, section of the game, actually. So we have to use him. Uh, Oswin here is a knight. He can only uh, wield lances at this moment. Na lights, knights are a pur purely defensive unit. Actually, I didn't, uh, yeah. Did I explain that? No, I did not yet. Which uh, reminds me that I need to make a video for this. Actually, I'm probably going to edit this on. Um, onto the, uh, the end of the video. So, I'm going to actually uh, do the setups a bit different from now on. Which is, um, which you will see. In this let's play, I'm going to do uh, the, the main story uh, event in one chapter, and then going to do the battles in uh, another cha chapter. And I will uh, discuss the units that we'll be getting also in that um, time span, if I have enough time. Mostly, we'll not be getting all too many, um, too many new units, so it will be fine probably. But we'll have to see, I will have to see how things work out. You will see how things en will end up once we'll get there. But I need to uh, really um, compensate for time, which is something that normally uh, I don't really have to worry about. Now, what you may or may not want to do uh, in this episode is... Um, 
further level up Rebecca. This let um, Oswin and um, Hector actually go to the, the shop over there um, and buy an axe and, uh, and, a, and a sword. One normal axe for um, Hector and one normal sword for Elwood. Which, because they are the main lords, um, these first weapons that they'll get here, the Wolf's Bane and um, the Rapier that Elwood has, those are actually their lord weapons. So they have those are the specific weapons that no one else can use. So it's pretty um, advice. It's 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 advice that you keep those weapons just uh, long enough for the for the game. You know, you will f eventually get um, better weapons for the lord, but it won't be for a while. So I'm actually going to get let um, Lowen here go into the armory and buy one sword and one axe. Because I don't usually use Lowen, like I said. Now what you want to do is just uh, end the turn, yeah, end, end my turn. I don't really care about him. Uh... Yay, you attacked, you hit him actually. Fine, yay. Well I need to heal you. Which is not so yay. Do you have a vulnerary with you? No, you don't. Do you? No, you don't. Do you? No, you don't. You do. You can finish off him. And do you level up? No! Oh well. Let's just trade the uh, vulnerary and use it. What you may want to do is uh, protect uh, or rescue Rebecca just in case. But most people aren't going to hit her, so you wouldn't have to worry about Rebecca all too much. Rebecca may seem weak now! But she is the strongest archer in this game, next to Will. And Rod is pretty strong as well, but I don't usually um, use Rod because he comes too late for me. And why that is, I will explain in, uh, in due time. Now the boss is gone clear. See, things are going well for me. Now the archer will uh, probably hit me. Yes, he will. Now Bartra is fully healed. Now, uh, you boss, how far can you hit? You will take another turn in order to uh, reach me. Which is good, which is good. Now I'm going to explain support. Support actually um, with our units that are um, capable of each other. Like for example, Hector and Elliot. And I skipped that conversation entirely. Which, sorry, but if you want to read that conversation you can read it for yourself. I accidentally skipped it because I usually skip it. And I actually pressed the B button in order to skip it, but... Um, I'm going to explain supports to you right now. With supports you're going to have special conversations like we had in the last uh, episode. In order to gain support turns, characters need to be three spaces away from each other. Not farther, uh, you can get closer but not, not, not far, only three spaces away. Now certain characters have uh, a number of set, uh, all characters have a number of set turns they can uh, gain in order to gain a support. Now, for example, uh, Elwood and Hector's are the most, are the least. Uh, they need the least number of turns in order to gain a support. Now, when they gain a support, they will have a special conversation and get C rank. You can talk to each character you can support with three times and get an A rank. Only, only get only an A rank with one character, 
and you can only speak to uh, to all characters. You can only speak to characters five times in total. Usually, that's uh, the characters you can talk to are related. Like for example, with uh, uh, with Eloise, you can only talk to uh, Hector and um, for example, Lynn. You can talk to her. Uh, to her. And you can talk to Loen and Marcus, I believe. But I'm not too sure on how many uh, on who you can. There are a bunch of units for different characters. Now what supports does is uh, two things actually. When you're in one to three spaces away from each other, you gain a battle uh, boost when, you, when, uh, when you're in the supporter range. And this will increase your avoid, your hit and your skill. Uh, which is the critical hit rate, your damage and your chance of your enemy hitting you in battles. Now, uh, what exact the numbers are is never uh, really explained. Uh, how much they um, do, how much status boost they give is never explained in any Fire Emblem game. So, nobody really knows. But usually, uh, Characters that gain support turns for a short amount of time uh, are better than the characters who um, take a long time in order to gain support. Now, there's one thing, uh, for some characters there's a special ending when they gain support levels uh, because they are in love or something, they can gain uh, special things, special endings and such. But we'll get into that when we get into that. Uh, the basic thing that you need, to, the, the other thing that uh, support does is that it gives you a slight boost in uh, in levels when you're actually, uh, yeah, when actually that. What am I trying to say here? You get a boost in levels. That's that's when you level up. That's what I want to say. Now we're back. Can you please finish? No, you can't. I want you to gain a level. Really, I do. As for you two, uh, you can you can probably finish him off, but I don't want you to finish him off because otherwise the char the chapter will end, and I don't really want that just now. Uh, you missed completely. And Logan, please don't kill him. Thank you. Thank you. You don't miss. Miss, yes. Thank you! Yes, it's weird, I actually want him to miss. Which is a weird thing to say, but whatever. But I hope uh, uh, sport are a little bit fake in the uh, Fire Emblem universe. But I hope I... God damn it. I explained it to you uh, to bet. I explain. I hopefully explained it to you a little bit. Oh, So... This was not so easy as it seemed. No, it wasn't. Actually, it was. Anyways, normally, this is the end of the episode right now. So, I will see you again in the next episode. Till then.